Hello everyone. If you are facing stress, anxiety because of exam, then this video is going to be helpful for you. My name is Pradeep Chaudhary and in this video, we are going to discuss the issues behind it and how you can handle it. So first thing first, why you are stressed during exam times or when your exams are near, why you are so stressed? First and foremost reason is overthinking. So you are overthinking about your exam, your result. Second most common reason is lack of proper study. Actually, these are interconnected. You are not able to study properly. That's why you are stressed and you are stressed. That's why you are not able to study properly. So this is a vicious cycle trap. Third most common reason behind it is over expectation. Your parents want you to score 95 percentage in certain exam and you haven't even covered your syllabus properly or you are over expecting from yourself. And last most common reason is proper sleep. Again, it is a vicious cycle. Because of anxiety, you are not able to sleep and because of lack of proper sleep, you are not able to study properly. And that's why you are more stressed. So in this video, we are going to discuss certain tricks which will help you to come out of this complicated situation. First and foremost thing is yoga meditation. Practice meditation and I know that if you are a beginner, it will be very difficult for you. I mean, you are going to say, what's the point of sitting alone? See, just try to do one thing. When you wake up in the morning, just try to sit for five minutes. Do not think about anything. Do not keep your mobile phone nearby. Just sit alone. Another important help is talk to your family. See, your family is your support system and you should talk to them. Please make sure that you do not talk to negative people. And if you are staying away from your family, make a habit. Make a habit to call them at least two times in a day. Once in the morning and then in the evening. Please make sure that you do this on a regular basis. And if you are staying with them, then try to have food with them. Be it lunch or dinner, try to have it with them. Next important thing that can help you is exercise. Any physical activity will be helpful. Be it dance, be it swimming, be it gym or running, whatever you can do or cycling. Just try to do some physical activity during the daytime. When you exercise, your body release chemicals called endorphins and these chemicals diminish the perception of pain. So in simplest term, when you are going to do certain kind of exercise, your body will release happy hormones. Next thing that can help you is music. Listen to the music that is calm and peaceful. Please make sure that you do not go for too loud music, but select the music which is calm or peaceful. In fact, while studying also, you can play some peaceful music that will help you to focus better or you can go for white noise. Next thing that is going to help you is mechanism of rewarding. If you have studied properly, reward yourself. For example, you like video games, then have a proper study session. And if you finish it properly, then play video games. Of course, there should be a time limit for that. Actually, yesterday I was watching interview by Mr. Bishan Singh Bedi. He is the former Indian cricket team captain. So he was saying that we should follow our Junoon and then it should be followed by Sukoon. That means we should follow our passion and then it should be followed by something which give the peace to your mind. So if you have studied properly then then do whatever you find peaceful and then again have a proper study session again reward yourself. So make it a cycle. Next important tip is plan and organize your life if possible in the night itself plan for the next day and please try to follow this 30 minutes rule. What is this 30 minutes rule? Try to start your studies within the 30 minutes of the time you wake up. Suppose you woke up at 7 a.m. Then try to be on your chair by 7.30. Finish your routine task within these 30 minutes and then have an amazing study session. See, your first session will decide the course of your entire day. If you are going to have first productive session, trust me, you will feel much, much better. So please make sure that within 30 minutes, you are on your chair to study. Next thing that can help you is prayer or if possible, when there is too much stress, try to visit any religious place. Depending on your choice, visit temple, mosque, church, gurudwara or any other religious place. See, this will give you peace. Just try to visit it once in a week. Another thing that is going to help you is to feed to the stray animals or to the birds. Give water to them, give food to them. And another important tip is that study in short shift. Actually, problem is because of anxiety, you won't be able to focus continuously for a longer period of time. Therefore, you should plan your study 
sessions in such a order that you keep them short. So you can try Pomodoro method. What is this method? In simplest term, you are going to study for 25 minutes. Then you are going to take a break of 5 minutes. Again study for 25 minutes. Take a break of 5 minutes. And in this 5 minute, please do two things. A. Hydrate yourself. That means drink a glass of water and 10 squats. I am sure these methods are going to help you. However, if the problem still persists, then please do not take it lightly and please consult the professional. Depression, anxiety is a serious issue. Please do not take it light. So in this video, we discussed certain methods and reasons. First is you are overthinking or you are not able to sleep properly or there is a pressure of over expectations or you are not able to study properly. Then how you can handle it? Try to practice yoga. Try to talk to your family. If possible, dine with them. Do certain physical activities. Listen to peaceful music. Reward yourself. Plan your life. Visit a religious place. If you are a follower of any particular religion, feed stray animals or to the birds and study in short shifts. That was all for the day. If this video was helpful, please let me know in the comment box. Or if you want me to cover any other topic, write it down in the comment box. I'll try to cover it. Thank you and have a great day.